The number 12 team in the nation with a block to end it in set four and a celebration for Wisconsin as they beat Purdue in four sets. Mike Wolf alongside Audrey Flaw. And Audrey, we got a really big inside look at the replay system in this match. Purdue using all three challenges, but in the end, it was Wisconsin who got the win thanks to the play of their balanced attack. Yeah, you know, Carlini did a fantastic job. This Wisconsin team came into this match with momentum and will leave this match with momentum. They're playing very good volleyball right now. And Lauren Carlini does what she does so well and distributes the ball to so many different attackers, five different players with eight kills or more for Wisconsin. Yeah, you know, you can't can't uh, underestimate the power of a great setter. You're going to see here that she opens things up for her hitter. She takes bad passes and makes great sets. You see her range here, moving the ball from one area of the court to the other area. And then she's got her share of heads up plays that are real big point scorers for her team. And then how about the sophomore outside and Kelly Bates tying a career high with 17 kills and throwing 13 digs. You know, Bates was a difference maker tonight, taking care of the ball on the outside. And you're seeing there Carlini moving her around a bit so that she's got some different angles to hit at. So Bates is really showing what she's capable of doing. What a great performance she had tonight. Wisconsin hits 275. They were actually out blocked though by the Boilermakers, but in that final fourth set, it was the Badgers hitting 297 to earn the victory. And Wisconsin improves to seven and four in Big Ten play, 15 and six overall. The Badgers celebrate at home on Halloween weekend with a win over Purdue.